Hey guys, it's OC Dosi here and I'm back with a skincare video for you guys. It's a DIY skincare video and you can literally do this for free if you have these products at your house. If not, buying them should not cost you more than three or four dollars. So I'm going ahead and adding that turmeric into the bowl. All the like ingredients will be in the description bar. I was trying to measure it but I wasn't trying to like, you know, take all that time. So I just eyeballed it. It was pretty okay because I was just eyeballing it. So after adding the honey to that turmeric, I mix it all up, make that mixture. I was so skeptical of doing this because I'm allergic to pretty much everything. Well, not allergic, but I have really sensitive skin. So pretty much anything will break me out. So always trying DIYs are so fun but so scary at the same time because like it could actually really help my skin or it could give me hives and make me have to go into the emergency room. So you know, I'm always cautious but I do try it out on my hand first before I try it to my face. But even then, you never know, I always have like incidents so whatever. I'm trying it out, I'm putting all that paste onto my face. It's like a, you know, orangey color. But I heard that it can um, stay in your skin, I didn't see that but you'll see so I keep that on for about 10 minutes while I'm taking selfies and like acting a fool and letting it drip everywhere let me tell you guys wear something you don't care that you get dirty and wash your face with something you don't care gets dirty because I actually stained my spin brush and I love my spin brush and I stained this like washcloth that I really don't care about so yeah, but make sure it's things you don't care about getting stains. And people say it also stains your skin. I didn't see that. And I realized most people who said that had like very fair colored skin, like they have were Caucasian. And maybe because I have pigment in my skin, it didn't stain my skin. Like my undertone of my skin is already yellow, so maybe that's why I didn't really show that I have like turmeric on my face. I don't know, but it did not stain my skin, so if you have pigment in your skin, I doubt it will stain your skin, but yeah. So I'm just cleaning that off with a washcloth and that wasn't working, so I got up and I went to go wash it off because I was getting fed up. And this is my results. Um, it made my skin really smooth, like really smooth, like really, really smooth. Um, that's really it. And the redness went down. Normally when I wash my face, my nose is like bright red and everything around my, like in my T-zone is all red. And the inflammation in that redness was significantly less. And I went ahead and used like my rose water serum onto my face and then I put a cream on my face. And yeah. Um, try this out if you guys have like redness inflammation problems. I feel like it also kind of helped with discoloration. What do you guys think? I feel like it made my skin a little bit more even. Let me know what you guys think. And thank you so much my friend Jackie for this idea. She did this on her Snapchat. And I've been looking for things like to try out because my skin has been bugging out. But yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Be sure to subscribe. And bye!